Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over the latest Toonly update, including the long-awaited hand animation setting. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. The latest Toonly update just landed, and while it's not a major one, it does include the new hand animation setting. Now we have had this hand effect tutorial listed over at Toonly.com forward slash tutorials for a while now, and it's generated a lot of interest. Well, the wait is finally over, it's here. In addition to the hand moving items onto the stage effect, the update includes a few bug fixes and small performance improvements. First, you're going to need to update Toonly if you haven't already. Normally the updates come in automatically, but this particular one is one of those rare updates that must be downloaded manually from Toonly.com forward slash members. And then you just follow the prompts to install it on your computer. Once it's updated, auto updates should resume moving forward. Okay, so once you have updated Toonly, go ahead and open up a project or create a new one. And we're gonna play with the hand effect. So, what is it? Well, let's just take a look at this little video I have here. Boom, right there. A hand brings in the object. That's it, and it's really fun. So how do we activate it? How do we make it work? Well, let's just take it, one of these objects here. This particular one, if you click on settings, you'll notice I have it set to instant. Instant in and instant out. Well, now we have hand as an option, and that's what we want. By default, let's go ahead and play it. It comes on like that with the hand is pinching it from the top, it brings it down. Well, you are not necessarily limited to that. So let's go back into this. Settings, hand, right here, we got a new settings icon. And Here's our default, as you saw, it's just bringing it from here down, and it's a pinch type. Well, we also have a hand type, so it comes in like that. You can also change the hand style. You'll see we have all kinds of different hand styles, including with or without watches, or no watch if you prefer. And then placement, so you can do it from the top as shown, from the bottom, from the side, or the other side. So let's do this one from the bottom. And then of course you can change even more directions. So you can have it swipe, swipe from the bottom. Okay, so there's all kinds of options. You can also flip it and change the color. So let's see what this looks like. See how it swipes that over like so. And truly, that is really it. We do have the full tutorial on the hand over at Toonly.com forward slash tutorials. And I believe it's number 14. So be sure and check that out for even more explanation on the hand effect. Anyhow, I'm excited that it's finally here and I hope you are too. Go ahead and play around with it and thanks for watching. Bye.